One of Australia's most loved authors, Ruth Park, has died. She was 93. Ruth Park was a child of the Depression and a chronicler of that time, though her career spanned 50 years. Adrian Rochella takes a look back. Generations grew up reading Ruth Park's books and watching those stories told in film. Who are you? Beatty Bow. Oh. Playing Beatty Bow was one of two dozen children's books she penned. She launched her career with The Harp in the South. Get a good job and get out of Surrey Hills. The 1946 book created controversy because of its raw portrayal of life in the inner city slums of Sydney. It was considered a, a betrayal of the myth and this is why there was a big rumpus about it. So that book really opened Sydney Sider's eyes to what was going on in areas like uh, Surrey Hills. It, it spoke of previously forbidden subjects, child abuse, abortion. Ruth Park was born in New Zealand and grew up in the Depression, moving to Sydney to work in newspapers. She also wrote the book and ABC radio serial, The Muddle-Headed Wombat. Wombat's eyes nearly popped out. Oh, mousy! Look what your wombat's gone and done! I've killed him as dead as dead can be! And in the late 70s, she won the Miles Franklin Award for swords and crowns and rings. What I've learned through writing television and radio has assisted me in uh, compressing and getting a more definite shape to a novel storyline. Ruth Park published more than 40 books and was made a member of the Order of Australia for her services to literature. Adrienne Rochella, ABC News.